Hey everyone. So we're gonna do some shoulder flexion work here for you. So simply stated, shoulder flexion is when you're pulling your arms away from your backside and away from the center of your body. So Neil's gonna face a wall. We're gonna use the wall here as visual feedback so that he, as he goes into shoulder flexion, he doesn't start to compensate by leaning forward with the body. So he's gonna set the stick behind his back. He's got his hands in a natural little wider than shoulder width position. From this start, he's gonna squeeze the glutes, he's gonna tighten the abs because he wants to be braced so that he can take away any compensatory patterns that he may get through his midsection or his hips. He's then gonna pull apart on the stick at about 30% tension. As he pulls apart on the stick, the lats are gonna activate. We got sc uh, scapular stability here. He's gonna maintain that light tension as he starts to pull the stick away from his backside or his butt. Once again, he's trying to stay nice and still and tall through from the butt to the midsection. He's gonna to start to pull that stick away. He's gonna to get to his end range. He's gonna hold it there for a little bit, start to build up that neuromuscular control and strengthen the shoulder capsule. And then he's still slowly gonna to start to pull it apart, just lower the stick back to the starting position. Do about two or three reps of those. Hold for about six to 10 seconds when you get to the top, so that way you really start to build strength in that end range position. Every time you come up, you should be able to come into a little bit more shoulder flexion, just slightly, even if it's just one more millimeter, that's still an improvement. So give it a shot and start working on that shoulder flexion.